or a convicted person should be abolished in Nigeria. It's high time they stop all this beating. It's not right. Or a criminal have done, they should not be beaten. They've already gone through agonies and pains. It baffles me. I don't understand what's up with Nigeria military personnel. Okay? Anyways, thank God and the families of late in the court injustice because Udwak is already pronounced dead by hanging for killing in the Obong nine months ago. So guys, thank you for coming again and watch the video to the end. Note that in the Obong Omori, who was a graduate of philosophy from University of Uyo, went for job hunting and never returned. The three persons who also stood on trial of late in were Udwak Abasi Akban, the first accused person, Frank Akban, and Awa Basi Akban, the second and third accused persons. However, the court discharged and acquaint Frank Akban, the accused father, and Awan Basi Akban, the accused sister. Job seeker murderer Udwak Frank Akban, who in 2021 April 29th eliminated one miss in the Obong Umori, has been sentenced to death by hanging by the Nigerian Court of Law. Guy Frank Akban, upon hearing his death sentence, tried to escape from the court premises and was apprehended by the heavily but the security guards that were positioned for something like this. The unexpected, we all know what happens sometimes in courts, okay? But before then, you will hear what transpired between late Ineobong Wemore and the accused persons would work Frank Akban. Mother in Uyo. Who killed in Umore? This is a question, a big one at that. On Friday, April 29th, a 26 year old lady set out around 1 pm to attend a job interview in Uyo, Akwaibom State. Having recently completed her university program, despite using good parents, that is to say, she is an orphan. She was looking for a way to support herself before being called up for National Youth Service Corps, which we call NYSC program in Nigeria, okay? So instead of a job interview and hope for the future, however, she would actually encounter on that day would become one of the most shocking stories to ever emerge from Nigeria. Nigeria is in Africa, my people. In the album, in the Umure, became the subject of a desperate nationwide search led by Nigeria Twitter users after her friend, Umo Udwak, put out an urgent appeal. She was eventually found but unfortunately, my people, the worst had already happened, which is, they don't delete them. This guy you are seeing on the screen deleted the late in the album. Hmm, I could not hear more still they come. Okay, so the police would later confirm that she was found deleted after being this one where after being kawashi forcefully that is i don't want to use the word arrow uh -huh. so she was um kawashi by force she was also deleted and she was buried in a shallow grave in the wake of a crowd source social media campaign which uncovered his identity 
the primary suspect named Frank Oduak Ezike Akban was also arrested. Hmm? Can you imagine? Two of them are from the same place. So if you can do this to your own blood, when I say your own blood, it's not like your same bloodline, but you are still from the same place, then who can you not do it to? You can do it to an outsider if you can delete your own flesh and blood. What I mean by flesh and blood, somebody that is from your state, you are from the same state, even though you are not from the same parents. Abba, the heart of man, the Bible says, is really desperately wicked. Okay? So let me continue, my people. They say, beyond the whispers, however, there has been precious little to substantiate the idea that strangling up Frank Akban alone will not represent any kind of justice for any umre. Hmm? So now so you, there are a lot of telephone calls between the time this girl left the house, according to her that she's going for job interview, and the time she was deleted by this uh, Akban, Frank. Okay? So they say anyone can get their hands on the call data from Frank Akban's line would very quickly be able to establish whether he was in fact acting alone. My people, this is a question. Do you think somebody is behind Akban? Because he's a serial killer. Oh my God, I don't want to use this word. He's a serial a, a bad person that used to delete people's life like that. Okay? Is he doing it for somebody? Or is it for some group of persons? Or is he doing it for pleasure? My people. So what is Akban all about? Frank, Akban is being used to take the fall for much bigger fish involved in any Umore's murder. And why Frank Akban is certainly the primary suspect? was directly involved. In the murder, there are other participants in the deletion or in the delete. Anyhow, I put them still working free. Do you would think so? Why the Aqua Ibon Police Command, they are still doing their investigation. Who is Frank Akban? And people want to know who he be, apart from the primary suspect. What is he doing for a living? What are his uh, um, agenda for him always uh, uh, disguangwaring people, kawashing people, and deleting them? Okay? <laughs> Take your camera. My friend, will you get her from my face? Will you get her from my face? Will you stop that nonsense?